Right now, there's a special World War II bomber at Tucson International Airport. And in just a few days, the B-17 used in the World War II movie Memphis Bell will take flight again. This time, you could be on board. Here's Not On Your Side's Marcelino Benito. Bombers just like this one helped change the course of history, and we hopped inside to take a look for ourselves and met a pilot who remembers all too well what it was like to fly these things in the heat of battle. 11 o'clock, hi. We were attacked by an estimated 600 enemy fighters on our way in and on our way out. So it was scary. But at just 20 years old, Richard Bouchong had to stare fear in the face, and he did it from the cockpit of a B-17 bomber just like this one. If you're not scared when somebody's shooting at you, you've got to be a little crazy. But uh, we went on and did what we had to do. Today, this bomber sits far away from any war zone at Tucson International Airport. This warplane used in the World War II flick Memphis Bell. It never actually saw battle. But Richard, I grew old in a hurry. And so many other pilots did. We helped bomb Germany into submission. Together in these flying fortresses, airmen dropped bombs on key targets across Europe, exchanging serious firepower with German fighters. Had a lot of holes in the airplane when we got back, but it, there were some scary times. Richard survived 28 missions on board a B-17. It was a tough old airplane. Including a day raid in Berlin. But everyone would not be so lucky. That was a terrible mission. We lost 69 heavy bombers that day. A huge toll that would only grow greater. By the end of the war, the U.S. had lost nearly 5,000 bombers, countless more lives in flight. And today, fewer than 15 of these planes can still take to the sky. I hope they gain an insight as to how tough it was. But they have to imagine somebody was shooting at them. <laughs> and even you can hop on for a ride this weekend. We'll post all the information you need on how to do that on our website, kega9.com. For now, we're reporting from the Tucson International Airport. I'm Marcelino Benito, Kega 9 on your side. Gosh, incredible stories.